guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica. If you're new, welcome for returning. Thank you so much for joining me back. So today's video is American Eagle Haul. I have not done an American Eagle Haul in a while. I, I actually looked back through my videos and this is the second haul I've done all year and we're in October. And I think that's pretty incredible for me. Um, considering this is a fashion, you know, YouTube channel. Uh, but I definitely have been trying to shop my closet so much more and you're going to see that in upcoming videos of me restyling things that you've seen last year, years before, um, in a couple of key pieces. But I do have some really great fall things that um, I really like for the fall time that I saw on their website that I absolutely had to have and just incorporate into my wardrobe. So if you guys want to see the items, let's just go ahead and get started. Oh my gosh, I cannot say enough of these of these. I have them in every single color. They started coming out with these, this version, I think almost two years ago, and they didn't have that many colors. Well, this year they came out with so many. I have the gray, I have the black, I have the green, I have the blue again. I got another blue, um, another like uh, cream color, and then when I saw these, um, like this coral, gorgeous color for the summertime, which I'll wear them anytime. I just loved pairing these with like a tank top and that's it. Like that's all I wore pretty much all summer was this version of this short and a tank top of some sort. I love it and I'm still wearing it a lot lately. And I have been getting the extra small and they fit really, really nice. Um, not too snug on my waist and I got enough room, you know, leg wise, but the length is great. They're not too short yet. They're not too long. They are just so comfortable. I can't highly recommend these whatsoever. I know in one of my videos before I mentioned, I think I was wearing the blue ones and I think I raved about how just amazing these are. So I'm, I'm just wondering for the fall or the winter time, you know, what kind of pant they're going to come out with. I'm sure there is one. I just hadn't really searched for sweatpants just yet. I'm still not ready for sweatpants just yet, but definitely recommend all of these. Get them all colors. We are going to do some graphic tees. They have some really cute ones right now on their website. Unfortunately, a lot of them are gone. The Hocus Pocus one, gone so fast. Beetlejuice, gone so fast. I know I wanted that one, those two, and there was a really other cute one with like the girls and they were walking. I think they had like pumpkin, like their fate, or maybe they're witches. I couldn't remember. It's so cute. Well, I couldn't get that one either. Well, I grabbed these. I grabbed the Dracula one, which I'm wearing now, and I absolutely love it. It's just, I love the wash, and it's just super cool and just relaxed and the material is so nice but i've been wearing this a lot i think it's perfect for you know you know fall halloween and then of course i had to grab the friday the 13th one i just liked it you know it's just nostalgic for me growing up oh that actually kind of matches together hopefully on camera it does because this pulls coral but weirdly this to me is like an orange. I don't know. That's crazy. I might wear this little combo soon. I don't know. I like that. All right. Next up is this denim button up. Oh, I like this. They have two different colors, a light and a dark. I chose the dark uh, for some reason for, you know, the fall time, but honestly, I think it doesn't matter. I just like, it's like a, I guess you could call it a jacket because it's definitely a little thicker than your regular denim button up and it's longer. It's, I think, really meant to wear with like leggings, a long tee, and you can throw this over so it definitely hides your butt. Um, but really great piece to have for the fall time to throw over. Absolutely love it. And I got an extra small and it already fits sort of oversized. So I definitely would not downsize in this one. Oh, I forgot graphic tee. Another graphic tee I got was this queen one. Uh, first of all, I love queen. Second, I love this green. And I feel like we're seeing a lot of like this military green, olive green. Um, and if you've been around, you know that I'm a huge fan of just green. It's just beautiful. It's almost like a jewel tone. So, and it's the, um, let's see. So it's a very glitter, glittery screen print. <laughs> That's what I was trying to get to. But beautiful color. I got an extra small and it definitely fits super oversized already. So again, I would not downsize on this one as well, but they definitely have some good graphics if you can get 
them before they sell out. Next up is a white denim button up, similar to the one I showed you, but this one, okay, so this one has the snap. So it snaps, button snaps, and then this one is just your regular um, button. And they had several colors and I did not know what color to choose from. I almost got um, the green, but I already have a green button up. So let me look on their website just a quick second. All right, so they have six different colors. They have a denim, which looks really super nice and super just, that one, this one looks really nice. Okay, so they have denim. They have a color honey that was like looks like a very beautiful, gorgeous marigold that I think I might have to have as well. The white that I got, um, they have a very beautiful um, light pink, and then they have um, an olive that looks is really pretty too, and then they have a wash black. So some really great colors for the fall, especially that marigold color. But I felt like white. I don't have like a. I have a white button. Up, don't tell. Don't get me wrong. But this one felt like a, just a little bit thicker than your regular like cotton button ups. I don't know if that makes sense. Like the material's a little bit, it's thicker. <laughs> Almost like a jean jacket, but not as thick as a jean jacket. Anyways, I think this is a great color to have that you can wear over your graphic tees with a denim, you know, skirt um, with uh, little boots, or you can do um, this with like a white tank and some denim jeans would look really, really uh, nice as well. Just super casual laid back, but. I just liked it. It was really nice. It's really super oversized as well. And I got an extra small, so I definitely would not downsize at all on this one. Okay, next up is something I have been eyeing, eyeing on their website. And I could not decide if I wanted this color or the other one, which is your traditional just trench coat, trench coat color. I love it. It is so nice. Um, I love how baggy like the sleeves are. It's like they're pretty big so that in you know you can wear a sweater with it. I have a really beautiful jacket from um, a trench coat from Zara. I love it, but it is so tight on my arms I have to be careful on what I wear underneath it. So it has to be very thin and so I could not wear it with the bulky sweater, but I love that these kind of give you that option because of the sleeves. They don't taper um, at all. And of course you could roll it up if it's too uh, long for you. I got a small because I wanted to wear it with sweaters as it got cooler so I could layer, take, you know, put on, take off. But I really like the color as well because um, I do not have a long trench coat like this um, in my closet right now. But I definitely recommend and I would probably size up if you want some room to wear some sweaters for the fall time. Next up. You guys, this is so comfortable, but also so oversized that it's almost too oversized that I don't know if I'm gonna keep it. But I can see myself, you know, when it gets really cold around the house wearing it, but I just feel like it really overpowers my, I'm five foot, so I'm petite, so I feel like it really overpowers my body, but I also low key really like it a lot. Um, they have a really beautiful gray one as well, soft oat. Um, I just really liked the color, of course, very neutral, very comfy. It is, it is nice. So next up is surprisingly a favorite of mine, and I did not know if I was going to like it, and it was definitely on a whim that I bought it, but I have nothing like this, but it is a sweater material kind of feel ribbed skirt in the color olive, and it is so gorgeous, so flattering on. I got an extra small because um, I didn't know like how it would fit and I didn't want it too tight but I don't know I just kind of I'll just go on and see what it what an extra small fits like but it fits so nice I can see it with some knee high boots an oversized sweater or even a tank top and maybe this you know underneath it looks so nice um, with the cape or even like a, if you have like a long duster um, I have like a piece of oh my gosh Piece of fuzz. Okay. Or it would look really nice with um, maybe the button up, maybe the denim button up, some little boots. But 
I also highly recommend this if you're looking for something different to wear for the fall and winter time versus your denim skirts because I don't see a lot of denim skirts kind of making their way. I mean, they're definitely kind of a staple that they always have, but I feel like right now you're going to see like these rib skirts and of course faux leather, but I think this is a great alternative to um, throwing something different in your wardrobe. And they also had different colors. Next up, I'll be honest, it's an iffy for me. I just, I don't know. I got a small in this one because I, because I actually felt like this looked like it ran small and I feel like it does. I don't know. I mean, I feel like it's definitely has this very 90s washed look. Um, you know, the, the denim, it like almost like an acid wash uh, color. I'm up on the fence on this. I could see it with like, you know, ankle boots, cute little graphic tee, you know, little bomber jacket or even like a faux leather jacket would look really nice. I'll let you guys know what I decide and what I, I don't know. I, it's still up in the air. I will, of course, you guys will be seeing this on me. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments below. Should I keep it or should I return? All right. Next up is a pair of denim pants. I will go ahead and say I will not be keeping these, you guys. Um, did not like the way they fit me. Um, actually, let me, let me ref track back. Um, I think the overall look are cute. I did not like the high, the rise of it. I wish it was like an inch higher. It almost felt like a mid-rise to me, but according to them, it is a high rise, in which it is. You know, high rise is typically like 10, 11, uh, but I prefer more of an 11 inch high rise um, on my jeans. I'm wearing actually some from them right now that I will share with you guys and you'll see in the screen. These have an 11 inch rise. These have a 10 inch and I did measure because I was like, gosh, it says high rise, but you know, they can come in various forms. So you just kind of have to, you know, find out, um, especially if you're buying them what the, the rise are. Cause to me personally, the lower the rise, it makes me just look shorter and I'm already short and I want to elongate my body and with a high rise for me up to my belly button, my, you know, natural waistline, that actually makes me look taller, and that's where I like to stay, even though these are baggy. And I even tried them on with even some sneakers to kind of try that kind of, you know, trend, even though I don't love it. But it looked cute had I left my t-shirt untucked because then you couldn't see the rise. But I just feel like then it made me look a little frumpy because it was an oversized t-shirt. And it was, it, just, it was definitely giving me, like, 90s, you know, vibes, which, you know, I grew up in the 90s, but... Um, I definitely wish they were just a little, um, higher in my opinion, but the ones I am wearing, I believe they still have online and I got them last year and they are wonderful. They have like these torn with like the, um, Buffalo print, um, fabric. So really super cute. I love, love the way that these fit. I believe I got a two and I think these are also a two, but they just fit different for some reason. All right, guys, that is it. That is my American Eagle haul. I hope you enjoyed it and you found some pieces that you might like for the fall time and add into your closet. Um, other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you aren't already, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye. <laughs>